So, for our future to be resolved, I believe there are four things, four simple things, that we can discuss. It's not, it's not going to involve which uh, political parties in the president's office. It's not going to involve the education system. It's not going to involve even our unemployment rating. But to find the solution, we, we must start and we must look within ourselves. I'd like to show you a picture of a box. And I like to call it the life box. Four identical sections equaling the path to success. The path to success in life. Now to me, success is defined by experiences you have with others that you love, that you trust in this journey called life. You share those experiences with those you love because that's what's important to you. That's success in life. Success in life is a mother nurturing her children. Success in life is a father being the foundation of his family. That's success. Success in life is, is that business owner who took his idea to a concept and has grown it with his employees to be a successful business. That's success. Whatever success may be to you, those three examples could all revolve around these four basic <coughs> principles in this life box. And the first section is called dream. You know, I, I think it's very funny how when you're younger, everyone tells you, what do you dream? What do you want to be? Everyone supports that dream. But as you slowly grow older, that same hope, that same drive, slowly fades away. And those same people who supported that dream, they go right away with it. See, dreaming is just a thought. It's just an imagination. And it's just a vision into something that not is yet realized. It's not physical. It's not tangible. See, dreamers to some people is a negative connotation. You know, those dreamers, those, they got to be drinking the water. He's a dreamer. She's a dreamer. I don't, I don't talk to them. A negative connotation. But for some reason, society has thought that some people who dream because they stop dreaming is a negative. Society thinks that just because others, the consensus stop dreaming, that those who dream are different because they're satisfied with life. I'm okay. I have a great job. I take care of my family. I'm okay. I'm satisfied. Is that what life's about? Really? Being satisfied? Being satisfied? People dream, others doubt, and that dream gets crushed. Because of what? Because somebody else told you it wasn't possible? Because somebody, somebody else told you that quitting your job to follow your dream is insane, so you called your boss back and said, I want rehired? Is that what it's about? Well, I'm here to tell you that there, that there are plenty of people who dream. And there, there are plenty of people that never go past that thought of dreaming. They never, go thought, they, they never go past that thought and that lure of imagination. But as you come closer to the second section in this life box, you'll pick up your true vision. See, there's a difference between successful people who dream and people who dream. Successful people become visionaries, envisioning that belief that anything is possible which leads to our second section of the box. See, this is a magnified illustration of an atom. And you know, the crazy thing about an atom is it's one of the smallest particles known to man. See, I, I believe the, the, the actual smallest is a quark, which is found inside the atom. See, the interesting thing about this small but large topic of the atom is that it was first mentioned and discovered by two Greek philosophers in the 5th century. The 5th century. No proof 
no factual evidence, no technological understanding, just the belief that matter was made up of tiny, invisible particles that we now call the atom. And they believed simply that nothing can be made from nothing. Belief. Well, that's it. That's it. Belief in your mind that everything lines up. It doesn't matter what everyone else says. It doesn't matter what your neighbors say. It doesn't matter what even your spouse says. It doesn't matter what your children say. Believe in yourself and your dream and you're walking down the path towards success. See, these two Greek philosophers, they look very attractive there. But that leads us into our, our third selective in, life, in the life box. Which is do. Doing what your dream is, is the most difficult part. It applies to all ages, all stages in life, in all situations. But what separates these select few, I think, and what, what, what will drastically change the world, and what we believe in, is the fact that doing and taking action requires one simple thing. See, I think there's, there's so many great innovations and so many great ideas that we'll never know about. They could change the world. But the individuals who possess the talent and the ability to do these thing, things lacked this last step of doing. See, it, it amazes me how the human mind works. For those who struggle at doing, it's simple. You see that? You see that on the slide? You, gotta, you don't see that? Oh, no. You got to fo focus. Focus. It takes focus. Focus. The secret is two words, four letters, and one space. Two words, four letters, and one space. See, telling yourself I can will change the world. Those two words could change our entire globe, literally. If everyone believed that they could, our future wouldn't need result. See, people can stop after a dream. They can stop after a belief. Because you know why? Nobody saw that dream. Nobody saw that belief. But the moment you take action, there's no going back. There's no going back. Your secret's out to the world. You've dreamed it. You've envisioned it. You've believed it. It's your passion. It's burning. Now you do it, and it starts with taking action. Focus. See, life without action, as we know it, will go nowhere. The world will still, the world will still spin. Your kids will grow up. Your husband and wife will continue to do their job. But for you, you won't go through with it. You'll find yourself back at the first stage of dreaming. Another great dream idea that you won't go through with it because you don't have the vision to see it through. It's that simple. See, the last and final section, it's the easiest after success. It's the toughest after failure. But you know what? It's an accomplishment that you got there. The last and final section is repeat. Repeat those three steps. Repeat those three sections. Repeat those journeys in life. And I'd also like to add that. I never said it would be easy. I never said dream, believe, do. Be successful the first time. Be successful the second time. Be successful the tenth time. No, you're going to have failures. Repeat. Repeat just means never give up. Life is never easy, and bad things happen to amazing people, and vice versa. But I guarantee, if you put your life in that box, in those four sections, lined up just so, you will find success within yourself. 
See, you can't, you can't mix up the order. You can't believe, do, dream, repeat. You can't dream, then do it, then believe it, and try repeating it. You have to dream, believe, do, repeat in that order. Now when people ask you to think outside the box, you just look up and you smile. You say, I'm all right. And share these four sections of this box for their life. Encourage others. Stay humble. And remember, if you can dream it, and you can believe it, by almighty, you can do it. And then just repeat. That's how we will resolve the future. God bless.